How's it going, YouTube? Just type QQ back with some more epic failure, some more hot trash, some more garbage, and, uh, and this time, a bit more of the same bad habits and, and, and familiar pitfalls, really. Uh, we're with Bullet Souls again, going for that 1cc uh, with you in here, the police girl, and uh, this is going to be our, this was, I think this counts as our second run with our auto bomb uh, clicked on, and uh, we're going to notice real quick that I'm, I'm, uh, I'm not one to get out of bad habits, you know, that's, that's, that's going to be uh, pretty apparent in this video. Um, yeah, I'm not sure if I have to sit down with my own videos and just dissect some of the errors that I'm making, uh, but uh, yeah, it's going to be pretty uh, pretty obvious that I'm going to keep doing the same mistakes over and over and over, like deja vu videos. Here we go, you know that sort of thing. Um, but yes, we're uh, we're attempting to do this on one continue. Uh, to the three lives with three bombs each so if we get hit uh, there's a bomb in the tray there it's gonna activate the bomb first if we don't need bombs it's gonna take a life that sort of thing so if we're all out of lives um, that's it you know stopping the video there that sort of thing um, but for the most part um, we, we, we do a, we do an alright job here in the beginning level but you know if you're gonna ask me if, if I have a little bit of a difficult time at the end of the boss, you know, let's wait and see. All I'm saying is there's a lot of uh, familiar reflex that I do, a lot of familiar bad stuff that I do over and over and over as if I don't have, you know, as if I can't learn from it, that sort of thing. But. Going for that double kill point. Don't get it. Don't get it there. Something happened. But oh well. And what some people might notice is I let that bomb uh, bounce around us as much as I can. It does actually go away eventually, so I can't just let it bounce. I have noticed that if you keep bouncing it, eventually it's going to feel pretty neglected and want to just, and just fuck off completely. But yes, I do try to keep it as long as, much, as, long as possible. Um, just for when I need it, but also just so it doesn't go away. Um, you know, while I'm already at maximum bombs. But there we are. Familiar, familiar, just mistakes. Doing the same dumb thing over and over and over. And, and losing a bomb here. Pretty silly, pretty pretty damn silly, considering you know we, you know sometimes a bomb can feel like a life as well at this point. Pretty, um, yeah, pretty foolish. It's just that sort of last last pattern of that boss that usually doesn't give me an issue, but these last few runs I've just been a, just a bonehead just running into things. Here we are at the, uh, the second level here. Yeah, this is, I guess, when they start really adding the spam to a lot of things. I don't find this level is a particularly hard level, however. Um, they do spam, but it's also a lot of uh, like weak enemies. You know, Even the mini-boss, um, or the few mini-bosses this level has, it, they're pretty easy. You know, there's the uh, sort of pink crawler guy that we're going to meet in just a sec. The sort of like blue train and then the uh, giant lizard, all of which don't really pose all that much of an issue. Here's the pink crawler guy that I was just discussing about before. Um, yeah, he goes down hard. Uh, he goes down hard. You know, he's as long as you're not sitting on top of him while he fires. A lot of the stuff, I don't know. He just it's almost as if he's not there sometimes. He doesn't. Post much of a threat at all. Dodge a couple bullets there.
Yeah, shooting those green boxes, those little hidden boxes. We can fire upon them while they're invisible. They pop up as green boxes. And do enough damage to those, they'll they give you a little bonus at the end of the stage. So that's a handy thing, especially if you're considering getting extra lives, which we certainly do want. But uh, yeah, uh, ho hopefully you guys are enjoying the uh, Bullet Soul runs here. Um, like I said, I think I'm, I'm going to concentrate on Bullet Soul for a little while here. Uh, maybe some Ikaruga here and there. It's just, you know, um, Ikaruga. She's a, she's a harsh, uh, harsh mis mistress. You know, so, so I feel where I'm already close to some, some respectable runs here. Uh, I'm going to see if I can power through and, and, and put one together before I tackle that that wild stallion of a game. So we make up that silly hit that we did there with that extra bomb there. So it's like, it's as if we're at a full strength again. But we don't have that lucky bomb bouncing around. And there we go, just as quick as we, as we got it, we lost it. And, in, and as you're finding out, it's these these times where I fall into the corner. And when I retreat into a corner, um, that's where the stuff really, really goes bad. Because of course, in the corner, you, you don't have much other place to go. You know, the boss is shooting you diagonally into the corner, then you're in the corner, and then there's no place to go. So you either make a, try to make a, just a crazy dodge out, or you're, you're going to get damaged. So there I am back in the corner, really not making some smart plays there, but you know, hopefully, you know, doing what I can from getting out of the corner as soon as I make it in. You know, ultimately, you don't want to move as much as, you know, you want to make a simple uh, motion as possible. You know, I feel sometimes the more movement you make, the more times that uh, you have to make an error. So it's kind of good to see the pattern as a whole and try to minimize your uh, movement throughout it. It doesn't always work that way, you know, especially when they start throwing, uh, you know, overlaying patterns that are at different speeds. Sometimes it just feels like it's just a fucking curveball and, and it just rains death, but again, there we are, a bomb in the corner. What can I say? What can I say? Same old, same old. doing an okay job there at the end um evading what i can of those double speed guys two speed guys that, that those patterns always kind of settle a little uneasy on me another no miss bonus certainly will help so we enter stage three with really effectively just two bombs missing from our normal stock. And the only way we're going to get bombs is if uh, we, I think we get that one single bomb right before we face the boss. So uh, even if we, we do a, uh, a perfect uh, no miss on the uh, On the stage here, uh, we're only going to be a, we're going to be a bomb down from our normal stock. So, so at least at this moment in this stage, there's no way to uh, really recover perfectly from the mistakes we've made. And uh, there we are, and it, and it gets even worse. Now we're hanging on a thread for our, for our first life here. Hopefully, we're not taking too much uh, too much more damage. But this is the level where they really start spamming spamming attacks, um, and you kind of really want to be on it. You're getting some good secret bonuses out of those eggs there. Once they are torn open, you get to defeat those red insects that crawl out of them, so you get a nice bonus out of, the, out of that. However, you 
however, we still have a long ways to go, that sort of thing. And, uh, and it's at this point I'm trying to stay on the laser as much as I can while diverting my main fire to other things. Um, trying to do my best to try to pop that thing, and for the most part I think I've given up on it now. You really have to give that thing, uh, you know, utmost attention to, to pop it, if not, uh, you know, a few bombs on there as well. Uh, the character Loop, that thing, she opens it up pretty easy, but then again, she, yeah, she, she beats the game pretty easily at that point as well. So we like playing with this, uh, queen alien, so hopefully she doesn't, uh, regret our, uh, regret the fun that we have facing her. But it looks like this time, uh, Everything goes according to plan. Oh, and it's and it's uh, this particular area with these red bugs and that goddamn meat shield right there. Fuck that guy. Nobody invited him. Fuck off. Power upgrade there. In the corner. In the corner. And just a big purple cloud just waiting for you. Yeah, should not have should not have waited there. But there we go, we lost our first life. Um, didn't really want to do it that early in the game. But you know that's it. You know, we're retreat retreating retreating the corners and just uh, I don't I don't know, waiting to die, I guess is the is the only thing that you uh, really leave yourself to do. Oh, those purple bugs, they really, you gotta take care of them quick. Oh, but right there. Uh, 60, 60 million is it? Looks like we scored a, a, a one up there, so effectively, effectively we are now at perfect stock once again. Getting pushed around by those mobs there, but it looks like we, we, we made it through just fine. So effectively, we, yeah, we are at perfect stock right now with that one up. But, you know, as great as that is, you know, we really probably should have one extra person, one extra, you know, life instead of getting back to our original. You know, I'm not so sure original can get us through this game. You know, we need, we need to kind of be sitting on as many lives as we can. You know, let that bomb bounce, I feel. At least for a little while. I uh, probably would have wanted to get that on the boss a little bit more than what it was right there. That really just cleared out bullets. Didn't really do a whole lot of damage. Yeah, I made a mistake of just getting a little too, a little too uh, silly there with the uh, guns constricted. Pink pattern there, trying to push you, push up up the uh, the side of the wall there, but got cancelled before it got too messy. And that's and, th and there it is. That's a, a simple pattern, simple pattern that I could have just weaved into. Instead, I let the whole pattern, you know, the whole uh, diameter of the pattern, push me in the corner when it really had no business doing that. Some easy patterns there with some looks like some weak areas in the boss just popping there. Did pretty good on that pattern. You know where where it's uh you know kind of obvious routes. You know, sure it's it's death everywhere, but where you need to go. Oh, very silly, very bad. We're just leaking bombs at this at this uh, juncture of this boss. Real, real miserable shit. But does not look like there's a whole lot left of this boss. But certainly taking way too much damage. 
in it, in really, it looks like it just it just gets worse from here. So now we're we are literally just pissing away that free life. And then in the moment we got it during this level, we nearly just pissed it away, pissed it all away. You know, no bomb bonus there, no uh, no miss bonus there, just. Just a pretty bad level altogether, you know. And as I would expect, it's going to be a long, long way until we get a, another free man. And we'd have to at least uh, finish up this level and get that bomb to uh, even the... Uh, To even go back to where we were, that sort of thing. Really raining down some enemies there. Then we got this nice big uh, mini boss here with many large areas to rip apart. In fact, I'd like to actually see more bosses um, this large. Those sort of long uh, battleship-like characters take up the whole top of the screen. And we live on. We live on. I'll tell you what. Some of these, uh, some of these larger enemies in this level are uh, quite a handful. Like uh, you'll see them, these sort of medium, medium-sized green ships. As soon as they sh bring, show up, they uh, they do fire a big spread of of uh, of nonsense. And there we are. We lost uh, we lost a whole new life there. And I'm even dumb enough right here. Just a giant. Just oh my god! Look at that. Just bleeding. I was gonna say uh, out of frustration, I drop a bomb, and then we just, we, you know, we just get hit again. So it's a, uh, um, yeah, something hit an artery, and we're just bleeding, bleeding, thrown into the corner. And here we go. It is, it is all hands on deck. This type of panic, you know, the boat sinking, and we're just like, you know, we're, we're pushing children and women out of the way to uh, rush to our uh, life preserver or our dinghy boat, you know, just absolute, um, absolute shenanigans, absolute panic and disappointment. Yeah, these are the type of ships I was talking about, just a large amount of uh, bullets there to clog up the screen, but you want to really take care of them before you, they're, they're allowed to do that. It's kind of a sneaky combo there to put them on the other side of one of these big battleships here. So you you have to uh, decide who you're going to uh, target, I guess is the word I'm trying to say. But uh, yeah, this this chat uh, this chapter in our Bullet Soul uh, voyage certainly is all about. Don't you're just falling into the corners, you know, making mistakes when we shouldn't be. Um, and then, you know, when things get bad, we, you know, we make it, we make our, make it our business to make it worse. That sort of thing. Uh, silly mistakes. We do get that bomb there to kind of protect our, uh, our life there. And. Uh, that this boss here with that little, you know, this little road of death, that little kink that comes up, you know, that little wave, that thing's been hitting me in uh, these last few runs, and uh, I got to keep remembering it's there and kind of avoid it when it shows up because I've been making uh, too many mistakes thinking that it's not gonna just kink right over and and hit me.
overall pretty pretty pedestrian type of pattern here as long as you uh, have patience and know when to sprint it. And it looks like we're, we've taken the boss down a, uh, a third of the way. And this type of, as I was just about saying, those type of patterns can really um, wear me down where there are different speeds coming. So we're down to our last life and three bombs. And I feel it's just, at this point I'm uh, making this a little harder harder than I need to be, but I wanna I'm trying to stay in the center of this stage and deal as much damage as I can to him to just get out of there. Um, but in the process we got we lost one of our bombs and it's yeah, it's it's not it's not turning in our way this run. It's a, it's it's long gone. Yeah, it is just uh just a disaster. Wow, wow, look at that. Bleeding, bleeding, bleeding. Um, you're getting out of it, but, you know, at what state? You know, no no bombs, last life. Pretty, pretty sad stuff. And now it looks like uh, we, we, we've made it to uh, the same stage we have been but in just a, a real worse state. Um, so, so it really kind of gives me some, you know, a conf conflicting feeling here where, sure, we've made it to the last level, but we also played really badly. So I wonder if this is our way of saying that, you know, we have kind of improved our play generally, just have made some really disastrous and moronic mistakes. And, and this run particularly, that's held it back to maybe personally, possibly going further than we have in runs in the past. But, but you know, uh, you know, that's something to contemplate as we uh, go further in. And there, and that, and that's all it right. All it, that's all it wrote right there. So we're gonna let that continue down to zero and uh, call that a run. All right, guys. Thanks for sitting down with some more uh, trash with me. Um, leave a comment, subscribe, do all that type of shit, and uh, I'll catch you guys next time. All right, have a good one.